when my youngest son was in like fourth grade, he and his best friend Jamal were playing downstairs, and they know the rule: don't go in Dad's office, right? Oh. I knew they broke the rule because I heard Jamal say, "Yo, how come your dad's got a bag of dicks?" Oh my god. <laughs> Oh my God, wait, here's the best part. I had never met his mother, only his grandma, and I was supposed to meet his mom. I was going to drive him back to the house, and I had already talked, and I said, oh, it's going to be so nice to finally meet you. So you know you got to say something, because you can't just let the boy go home and With tell the bag his of mom, dick. you know, because it's like you need her to know, like, one, I didn't offer those to him. <laughs> I'm not offering dicks <laughs> yes, to your child. Yeah, they were not in a place he could do. I wasn't like, hey, check this out, boys. You got a Rolodex of dicks and oh my God. thumbing through them. I I didn't say shit to the children now, right? I was, you know, That's I just crazy. yelled down, yeah, get, 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 and they head. got scared, yeah. Yeah, but yeah, I had to go and, and just, uh, it, 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 <laughs> so I got it. I was like, I gotta say, uh, uh, yeah. Anyway, she was finally, she was like, it's fine. She was like, it's cool. She's like, he's gonna be traumatized one day when he goes in the wrong drawer in my room. Don't worry, it's, oh, it's good. Man. And I was like, thank God. I'd much She's rather not be someone else or something. Yeah, yeah. I'd much rather. Not. I would. I would. I don't know how to feel if I went to my mom's house and drawer and found. Oh, oh God. God. 